Speaking at the inauguration of the chairman, Ado South ADP Elders Council, the national leader of the ADP, Senator Roland Owe, said the current challenges of insecurity and the state of the economy are unacceptable and therefore need to be addressed, maintaining that the ADP's primary objective is to bridge the gap in the polity. Senator Ware, who urged the federal government to execute the second part of Outer Ring Road project from Sapla Road bypass to Uluku and complete Second Niger Bridge and the East West Road, added that the inauguration of the Ado South Elders Council is part of strategies to strengthen the party ahead of the 2019 election. The father that will be inaugurated today and the members, I do where I live who well here. Where do you see the truth, you stand by the truth. We, 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 we collectively chose him because we know every coup he will be just. Because where there is no justice, there cannot be peace. In his remarks preceding the inauguration, Chairman Edo State Chapter of the Action Democratic Party ADP, Gabriel Olorun Tobi, said the choice of pa Gabriel Obano as the Chairman Edo South Elders Council is based on his integrity. We have an authentic Chairman of Edo South Elders Council. I have seen in him that with him we can go and sleep at the state level. Because let us not deceive ourselves, Edo South determines who rules the state. In his acceptance, pa Gabriel Obano pledged to contribute his quota to the success of the party and admonished the party leadership to remain truthful in all its dealings to sustain the wide acceptance across the country. Also in his contribution, a member of the party in Edo South, engineer Matthias Ogunsui, expressed his confidence in the leadership of pa Gabriel Obano. If we take this team on a truthful platform, we will never lose. My father, my pa, Abano, <coughs> who has been made our chairman of the board of the elders, uh, is a round peg in a round hole. Like they said, I would I know some few things. Sonny Duke Okosun reporting.